What's going on guys? Today we're going to be showing you how to basically install a replace mod quick and easy. This is the easiest damn trick in the book. So let's get right on to it. First you're going to turn on your open IV. Turn on your open IV. Click on Windows. All right, once you get done, if you have a mods folder, you'll click on mods. Well, matter of fact, you don't even have to do that. Just go right up here. You'll see a little box. Open search. Saying if the name of the car is, uh, let's say, the name of the car file is Ruiner. That YFT. You'll do a search for all the Ruiner files. There goes one, there goes two, there goes three. Three different, there goes four. Four different Ruiner spots for GTA. So what you do, you click on the first one. Drag the file, the car files out, drag them in here. Make sure this is on edit. Make sure edit is on. Runner, drag them out, boom, drag them in. It's going to automatically replace the car that's in there. And uh, let me see if it'll load. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, you're good to go. Then what you'll do, go to. Go to the next one on the list, drag and drop the same files over and over again. Then the third one, drag and drop the same files. Then so on and so on until you're done. Then once you get done, you just search up your next car. Let's just say if the next one is, uh, hmm, Buffalo 2. This is Franklin's car in GTA. So you double click on it. If it's not filled up and all that stuff, the screen bar load all the time. Double click on it. You go to it, drag and drop the car. Boom. Franklin's car for me is this lifted truck. But that is how you do quick and easy replace.